Welcome to this week's episode of College Kids Cars. I'm here with Austin this week and his 04 Evolution. So, what all have you done to it? When I bought the car about a year ago, it still had a stock engine in it, and it was pretty close to what it looks like right now. It's got turbo back exhaust, a race tech driver's seat with a Corbo passenger seat, trough harnesses, custom nine point cage. It's got a cognition carbon fiber rear wing, 18 by 10 and a half NTO3 plus M wheels, so with the 275 35 Maxxis RC1 tire and Sparco tow straps. As far as traveling goes with it, do you drive it every day? Do you just drive it, you know, for track days? Um, for the most part, uh, no, I really only just drive it when it's nice out. Certainly not like our wonderful weather today. Right, right. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh, I've, I've driven it from here home to Chicago um, one time in 19 degree weather, um, which is terrible. I'm sure. Uh, Cause yeah. there's, there's no HVACs, there's no heat, there's no AC in the car. Um, so you either freeze or you fry, depending on the weather. Um, and I bought the car in Arizona. I uh, drove it back up to Chicago, 30 hours, which was awesome, really awesome. Um, uh, but also kind of terrible, because it doesn't have cruise control. Yeah, um, it looks like and, it's pretty gutted, so yeah. it's not very comfortable. Yeah, I mean, eh, it's not, as far as comfort goes, you'd be surprised as far as what it is. When I picked up the car, it was 110 out. Um, so that was terrible. And then the next day I was in Colorado and it was 30 and snowing and that was terrible. And then the next day I was in Iowa and it was torrential downpour and that was terrible. But it was a cool trip. So it's terrible <laughs> than anything but sun, right? Yeah. Warm, warm sunny for, weather. For the most part. Okay, so of all the modifications you've done to the car, now that we have the hood open, you want to point out some of your favorites? Probably two of my favorites are the valve cover, powder coated that over the winter, and my catch cam, because I was able to make the, all the mounting and the hosing for it is all custom made that I did myself. What about the most expensive thing? Want to point out the most expensive addition to the car? I guess the most expensive, like, individual piece by itself probably be the turbo. It's uh, about a $2,500 turbo. Cool, cool. All right, thanks for watching this week's episode of College Kids Cars. Thanks to Austin for showing us his car. And as long as I don't freeze to death, tune in next week for a new episode.